right, we're starting the recording. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. I know y'all are so excited to be here and learn from Sherry. And yeah. she has so much to share with you, but you gotta listen to me talk for a few minutes, okay? And then we will talk to Sherry. And then we all get all get to all hear from Sherry. Um, you want to shut Mel up? Okay, a couple of announcements really quickly. Um, I'm sure most of you guys know that career conferences this weekend. <laughs> And like I said, if you're going, make sure you grab a hat and a leg, because we're going to wear those all weekend, so everyone knows who the Dover Spike area is, yeah. right? Yeah. And hopefully you got to check your box there about any announcements about career conference. However, if you are not registered for career conference and still have a desire to go, you can still go. Yeah. Okay, you can still go. We would love to have you go. I went to career conference four days in. Like, literally, I didn't have my starter kit yet, and I went to career conference, so you can come in if you want. Um, and so you don't have, I mean, there, there, there's, there's still time that we have spots, we have spots in rooms, we have carpool, we can make it happen. And so if you have a desire to go, it's an amazing conference. If you don't know what it is, ask one of the ladies with a hat, <laughs> but it is one of the, it's the most powerful event that happens locally, um, every year. And you get to hear from the top people in, in the whole region. There are people coming from New Mexico and California and North Dakota and like, they're coming from all over this year. It's kind of crazy. And so you're going to get to hear from them. There's a, it's a great girlfriend weekend. It's a literal, literally 24 hours of tower packed inspiration, motivation, training, fun. Okay. So y'all want to go talk to me. There's still spots. Okay. Um, let's see. The other thing really quickly about that is this Friday there is, we are doing a red jacket luncheon for anybody in their red jacket. So if you get in your red jacket, shh, with three active team members by Friday, you can come to the Red Jacket Luncheon. It's at the Cheesecake Factory. And um, you get special training beforehand. So if you have more questions about your conference, um, ask later. Uh, let's see. Okay, the other big thing I want to make sure everybody is aware of this month, the company started this um, new promotion with the starter kit. Number one, they get a brush set in the kit this month. So anyone that signs up this month, gets a free brush set in the starter kit. That's $55 value. Are you excited? Professional grade. Professional grade. Well, if you're excited, then you need to share it with anybody and everybody that wants to know about your excitement and your enthusiasm about the brush set. Um, you seem excited? All right, we got it. Lucky. And actually, anybody who signs up this month, they get the brush set, but here's the really cool thing about anyone who signs up this month. From now until June 30th, anyone who signs up between March 1st and June 30th, their first three team members, they get to offer them $25 off their starter kit. Do you guys get that memo? That is a huge yes. deal. So how many of you want to earn the cruise? Woo! Okay, you want to get real excited about this promotion because anybody who signs up this month can move right into her red jacket like that. Um, I have a girl who signed up in Indiana. She signed up like a week ago, already has her first three team members because she got so fired. She was in Mary Kay before and got so fired up about this $25 thing. She's like, I can't even believe it. Like a week later, she's in a red jacket. You guys, those of you that want to earn the cruise, that's one of the qualifications is three red jackets. Use this promotion because they'll be able to move real quick. Now, those of you that um, signed up last month or recently, don't get all sad. Think, oh my gosh, I could earn this cruise. Who can I share with that they can have that opportunity too? Got it? So get excited about that promotion. Um, the other couple of announcements I want to share about is you guys, how many of you love the food that Kelly makes each week? Woo! I mean, yeah, she deserves a huge round of applause, y'all. She does that out of the goodness of her heart. She's here every week, and I know we all appreciate it. However, I know that she is not getting compensated for it. So if you love it, I'd encourage you to, to, to let her know and to compensate her for it because she does it out of her own money. We don't pay her. We don't collect anything. It is not, you know, like we don't have a bucket there um, to, to collect. But Maybe I know, I think there. we should probably have a bucket. Um, but I just want you guys to know that I care about her enough. I don't want her losing money off this, okay? And I don't want her to get burned out. If we love having it and want her to keep doing it, I would encourage to make sure that you're doing your part, that if you're participating each week, that you're compensating her, okay? Um, I think we said like about five dollars a week, or what did you say? It's like normal five dollars ish. Um, now we will maybe have a bucket. Would you like to eat on that, Christina? Oh, yeah. I've got the bucket. Um, <laughs> I've we will get the bucket and have it there because I I just don't want her to get taken advantage of. Okay, you guys, because I know we love her and I know she's doing this out of your goodness. 
or I don't remember getting enough, okay? So, but there is other ways she can pay, right? I think you said on our Facebook yeah, I have page. Cash app, Venmo, Google. She'll, I'll have her bump it up or she'll bump it up or whatever. And so if you want to donate, just make sure to do your part, okay? Because we love having her and we appreciate it, Kelly. So we all appreciate that. So make sure she, she's getting compensated. We'll have a bucket that's for you later. Yeah, I <laughs> That is tax deductible. Yes, it is. Y'all got tax deduction, right? <laughs> <laughs> she will have no problem making receipts. Oh, she will. She will. Well, we can have a bucket and a little sales receipt ticket. There we go. There we go. I love that. Yes. You have your new restaurant. I love it. Okay. Okay, good. Well, thank you, Kelly. All right. Yeah, the last big announcement that I'm excited about is, so Sherry, you know, it has been coming down uh, once again because she just wants to and she loves and cares about us. Oh, well, let me share about this really quickly. Those of us going to career conference, okay, I have to tell you, so I'm like, Sherry, what can I do for you? Like, you know, you have been so good to me. And do you know the one thing she really wants? She wants to sit with us at career show up and that means you you respect her and want to hear from her so without any further ado i am going to turn it over to miss sherry schlapp <laughs> What are they? 
time is because I want to spend a lot of time to master the club because there are important pieces to the, there's important results that you want to see from your class but usually as a consultant and partly as a new consultant when you walk away what are you thinking about the most your sales you're thinking about the cash you made or didn't yes make. you got other huh or didn't make yes or didn't make because yes we care about all the other Pieces of this business. Come on. Show me the money, honey. Right? <laughs> right? That's, that's what we need to see. That's what affirms us, even. Or we feel a little downtrodden if it's a zero sale. How many here have had a zero sale class? Okay. Anybody want to tell me how it felt? <laughs> so crushing. Crushing? Bad. I crushed what I did. Yeah. It was wrong with or those did it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. I said it was wrong with those people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How many of you have had more than one zero self class? Okay. 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 All right. So I can tell you one of my first zero sale classes was in the of course, you know, in the beginning of my career. And at that time, I mean I started my business because we just lost everything and I had no money coming in. So I was going through my first classes with, okay, Lord, as a new Christian too. Okay, Lord. <laughs> I'm <a> deal. <laughs> I need this much money to pay my water bill tomorrow before it gets cut off. Or I need this much money to pay my energy, my cell energy bill. Or I need this before the phone gets cut off. And then I would have zero class. <laughs> it's like, hello. And so what I learned very quickly, and I tell this to my unit as I as new people come. I just pray that the Lord will show me how he wants to use me in their lives and them in my life. Okay? And just use me however you want. Okay? Now, I totally believe this is why I am blessed with the customer base I have, the sales I have, the passion I have for my business, and, and the selling and the customer service and that sort of thing. Because I really try to walk away from that zero sale, zero class sale, and just be okay with it. And most always, something comes back to me in another way later, whether it's a recruit, a team member, or some other kind of trick of the heart. Something I, I notice every time there's something that came from that zero class. So I have <coughs> to let that go and not worry about it because it's not you. Even if it was something that you could do different or better, it's just not you. There's always going to be You're always learning and always growing. To this day. To this day, within the last three months, I've been having zero class. So see, it doesn't matter how many parties you've done. You're still going to have them. Okay? All right, so where was I going with that? So um, the most important part, open and the close. We care about the money. But I was telling the group earlier, and you'll hear this piece, and, and that is when I'm talking to a consultant, especially the new ones who are calling me up after their first classes and telling me how they did, okay? There's questions that I ask of the director, and the questions I ask are in a certain order, okay? And who from earlier can remember what I said? How many yeah. Well, that's all right. Let's go ahead. Right. How many get here? Right. Yeah. How many new skincare customers do you have? That's my first question. How many bookings? How many bookings did you come home with? How many referrals? How many marketing appointments? Or marketing yep. appointments. Yep. Or you know, interviews. And then <coughs> one, what was your What was your sale? Because I know you want to talk about that. <laughs> okay. But I'm a happy camper if nothing else happens but I came home with a booking. Because I'm still in business. Mm -hmm. My interface. Yeah. Okay. So that's a good thing. So we're going to spend a lot of time 
talking about the code and that's for them. Okay. Now, before I get into that, I'm going to this is like totally random, kind of off that subject because I brought it. I'm going to show it to you tonight. I brought with me how I pack these more. Because several of you asked me to show you what I do when I put together an order for someone. So I'm going to show you all the little details that I do. Because one of the things that we'll talk about in the next three weeks is customer service and your signature. Your signature, your stamp on what you do for your marriage Do y'all have one? Yes. Really, it is. Because Mary Kay spent a lot of money branding us. I'm the next step. Now I'm going to make sure I've branded me. How many of you feel like you've had that goal for you? Yeah. Okay. But not enough of you. So we want you to be confident in that. Because I think it makes the difference. So one of my accolades is that out of 25 years in the business, I think I've been in the <coughs> sales for 25 years. And I take the cash now because I just have too many rings. <laughs> my mom and my sister my mom had both of them and when she died nobody can find them so i wear my favorite one so this is this is the last port of sales ring i got no i should even get this one would get how many of you have this one Okay, so can you believe this? I'm on Can you tell them how much it is to do 40 sales? We have lots of new people in the room who okay. don't even know what that 40, means. 40,000 in retail sales. In a year. In a year. Yeah. Okay. And, and she's so, done that how many years? Uh, I, I think like 22 or 23. 22 or 23. So we've been doing it for a long time. So one of the things I've done is. Do you know I, what your highest year was? Yes. Can you tell? Before it was 40,000, when it was 36,000, my highest year was like 49. <coughs> and I was in the top. Um, Henry. Cool. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Woo! -hoo! And every year, I think it's the 45th anniversary because I got a special oil change from Mary Kay. Ooh. Ooh. I love that painting. Huh? I love that painting. I wondered where it is. Yeah. That's where it was. Yeah. So I've also been in the Queen's Puerto Recruiting. Three times, so Woo. not 24, 23, but I'll take it. I don't think I know how to recruit. I'm not the master recruiter for you. <laughs> yes, but that's what we, we learn from each other. So where, where was I going with this? What was I saying about this? Uh, uh, sorry. Signature. 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 Branding yourself. So I think those are all things that make a difference. And so we're going to be talking about that in the next few weeks as well. And so I brought this today because we ended up doing a little bit of pivoting on what, what today's contents are, agenda is. So I'm going to show you this today, okay, on how I package. So, um, first of all, there we go. Um, I hope I have enough here. We're going to pass these out. I hope oh, I have enough. I love you. If I you love already them. have one, okay. don't take one. Yeah. Let others take it. Unless there's any left, you can have one. These are my thought four days. This is what goes in mm -hmm. everything out of my office. Everything. everything. Everything, even bills. My rent check for the <laughs> studio and the bills. Yeah, everybody gets one. Okay, so these are some of the things I have done to set me apart. Yeah, mm -hmm. that make people feel special. <clears throat> and when a woman is in an office with a bunch of cubicles, and the woman next to her becomes a consultant, that's convenient, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And that could be scary. Right? Because not every consultant works and operates the way they should mm -hmm. on the go give. Mm -hmm. Where she finds out that she has a consultant and says, absolutely not, you need to stay with her, she's taking good care of you. Not everybody works that way. So how can I be confident that those women in the cubicle next to the one that just became a consultant is going to stick with me? Mm -hmm. It's going to be because of how I take care of her. She's going to say, you know what? There is nobody that takes care of me. There's nobody who can take care of me as good as Sherry. I mean, that's what you want them to say. Mm -hmm. That's what you want them to think. You want them bragging on you to the other consultant. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So it's the little things you do. Okay. So the other thing <coughs> is, I only, because I found out I'm running low and I have to buy more. So I couldn't bring the whole bag. But so the thought for the day goes in every order. 
A business card goes in every order. Those, that's your, that's your cheap advertising lady. Yeah. The business card lady. Always give them, I don't care how many they have at home. <laughs> you give out a business card. That's just what you do. Like you brush your teeth, you give out a business card in every order. They pass it on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. You also put a lookbook in every order. Hmm. Every order. I think I said this on a message once. I do not like those companies, those women, those consultants in other companies that when you ask them for the catalog, like, I want to get it back or I need to get it back. I mean, they're nice, but they want to be back because they're so expensive to them. Hello? You can't be that way. You cannot be that way. Give your look for it. It's the most beautiful catalog out there. Okay? And I know it's an e world out there. <laughs> But people still like to look at our report. Yeah. I don't care what you think of Blaze, they just do. Okay? So that goes in every order. Okay? The other thing that goes in every single order, I don't care how little they buy, is a first buy same thing. Every order. That's SLP, standard operating procedure. Okay? <laughs> All right? This goes in every one. And then this phase your mint. Anybody know what a phaser mint is? Okay, so if we're gonna pass a couple of these around. You cannot eat them. Because I only have. Oh. How do you spell that? F A Z I E R. All right. So. Now, it can be anything you want. I mean, I hear people tell about how they put the chocolate chips in, they put the dust in. It can be whatever you want, okay? There's, there's a method to my madness. There's a reason I use phaser mints because they're different, right? They're not the typical Jolly Rancher chocolate kiss dove that everybody else does. <laughs> so it's phaser mints. You get them from Mountain Man. I think you can order them online. So Actually. we all group it. That's okay. Because there's still, think about how many married people that are in this. Yeah. Right? We're still a small percentage. Go ahead and copy me. Okay. 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 So um, one of my favorite things that I post every so often is my customer, he's one of my very good customers in Plant City, Florida. Oh, too bad you gave that up. Did everybody get to look at the baby man? Oh, sorry. Oh, were they keeping it? What is is dark chocolate with mint inside. Oh. And when you bite into it, it just like drips out. Okay? Wow. They're really good. If you don't like mint, they don't care. Because they give it to somebody in the house because he doesn't like mint. Okay. At some point, I might surprise you and tell you whoever has it in their hand doesn't want to give it to um, um, okay, so anyway, so, <laughs> so Sarah, Sarah's in Plant City, she had a little boy and little girl who were like, I don't know, like three and four or something like that, right? But she took a picture and sent it to me. They know when the Mary Campbell ups come in the mail. And they get them. And oh. they get to open them. No. And they get the chocolate. And she took a picture of them because it was in Florida. They had no oh. chocolate all over their face. Oh. But that's what they go for first. I'm telling you, these, this is your signature. These are the impressions you want to make. Now, when I heard that news, when I heard that news, the next order I sent her, <laughs> oh, <Sorry>. oh. <laughs> <laughs> when I heard that news, the next order I sent her, I took, I don't know if you guys remember this, but there's a little black mesh bag that had a mascara sample in it. Mm -hmm. yep. Thank you. I took those and I put a hand cream in one and a handful of mint. And then I took another one, black mesh bag, and I put a lip protector in it. Um, so that was full price product, I know. And a whole bunch of top phaser mints. Packaged them both in their own envelope to the beautiful McKay to the handsome Nolan. Aww. And then I sent Sarah her package. Okay? So they all got a package in the mail and they all got their own mints. But you now, do that to everybody though. It's beautiful. Yes. 
I do that. Every, hands off that the press press. every press. single letter she sends sends to the beautiful, the beautiful. kid is so respectful. I get it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think that. it's sweet. Every yes. single, every single yeah. um, thing she sends out always says to the beautiful. Tell them about the story about the, the post office lady. Which one? <laughs> the one that was like, oh, you didn't put the beautiful on this one. Oh, did I tell that story? <laughs> that's a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, that happened. Yeah, I was thinking back in the post office. Yeah. <laughs> and you were and and then you were just shipping something back to JC Penny. Or something. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. Even my pastor, when he gets things, he's yeah. not some pastor. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, so yeah, all these things. are all things that make them so special that they they find themselves talking about. The new package comes in the mail once a week with some conversation going on in the household. I mean, I have heard stories about what the guys are doing. They are making fun of them because, oh, Bruce, Bruce got married to a lady with that name. Mm -hmm. She's calling me beautiful. And the wives will say something like, well, at least she does. <laughs> 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 right. Seriously, those are the things I've heard. That's okay. You want to be talked about. You're making an impression. Okay. And so, what do you think that did for Sarah when I sent those two kids little packages? She loved me. That, 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 they loved you. Yeah, they loved you. Yeah. They love you so you just do these little things. What does it really cost you? In the whole big picture. Couple you bucks. You got a customer for life there. Yeah. Of the heart. I mean, those are priceless things that you do to build your relationship with them. Okay. So the next thing, the other thing I think about is I have a large customer base. I had to think that I was going to be big even when I was small. And so I thought about what am I going to want to do when I'm big, when I'm bigger, right? And more busy. And so I'm kind of a very simple person, and I like to keep things simple and streamlined. So I get, I hear about a lot of ideas for packaging, and they're beautiful, they're awesome, they're wonderful. For me, I'm not going to do it. It's too much time to get the ones. It's too much time to wrap every little item in tissue. It's too much time to tie balloons. I mean, I'm, there's just, for me, there's certain things I'm not going to do. So it's got to be slam, bam, quick. That's how I look at it. Okay, so if I'm, and of course, if you know where your product is, I'm gonna lay all this stuff out here. Okay, if you know where your product is in your house and you know how it flows, okay, that will make a difference how efficiently you're doing things. Is that a funny joke for some people? <laughs> <laughs> it could be. <laughs> because now, yeah. talk about that. Yeah. You should have simply set up. You might not have room for product and you have them stored underneath the deck. Okay? That's okay. Whatever you have to do, you have, you have to think about things functioning for you, mm -hmm. having a flow, fix what makes you nuts. And so I don't care what your, your confinement is in your quarters for product and whatever, create mm -hmm. a flow of how things go together. To have, you know, what's the thing you sell the most of? Probably time-wise. So to have my time-wise sets here, but I've got my singular boxes over here, that doesn't make sense. So you're going to have things flow, your color together. Your, your bags should be someplace that you can grab one. You walk it, you know, you walk into that room wherever you're putting orders together, you're grabbing a bag and you can just kind of go in a little circle and you know where things are and you can put things together. You've got to be efficient. Or you're not going to want to put those little patches on. Okay, so I have efficiency in my office and how things are flowing, where the mints are, where the hand creams are, where the thoughts of the days are, everything. So I can grab all that. In fact, so a lookbook and let me find my sales slip here. I do sales slips. Everybody knows I like the pitching in my business. <laughs> I like to write up my sales slips. I like to tear out their copy. <laughs> I don't give them this copy. And I take this and I fold it in half and I tuck inside of it my business card, my thought for the day, wherever I put it. I got one right here. Okay. And I used to give out holiday box. I'm doing it a little different. 
in here, but my holiday bucks would go in there. <coughs> they earn through the air. And then I'm going to tuck that down inside the big black bag. Okay. And then along the side, I've got my lookbook. Okay. And then I like to give them cards about some other products. Hmm. You can say what I make up. So this is my Can you send us those, of course? Yes. <laughs> And I'll, I mean, I'll pass these around. I have a, ma a card on the Dell mask, the mascara, the last thing I'm doing, you want to see now, the professional impression. Yeah. I wrote that up because I didn't want to hand write that every time I sold one, right? And the bio mask. Don't you need, think that needs some instructions oh, on yes, how to use? Yes, yes. So if I sell a bio mask, I'm going to give them a full instruction card. <coughs> For fun, they get this card on all the uses of. Makeup remover. Oh, yeah. How to do the C wear. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And then I told you I don't use the beauty book and I don't use the little insert of the beauty book. But after they're already on skincare, I might drop this in. They're already on skincare and they might look at this and go, oh, I want that collection. I want that mix and mask collection. So, I mean, it puts it to use. I can drop it in sometimes, right? All right. I trust my customers that they don't give me credit cards. Several still like to send me checks. I make it easy for them. I send them a payment envelope. Okay. The blending sponge. I even have that instruction, how to work the blending sponge. Okay. Um, so really quickly, those you only put in there if they bought that thing? If they bought it or if I'm romancing it for them. Okay. okay. And then I had a bio mask. It's a oh, right here. oh, here we go. I also am pretty giving. The only way sometimes to get them to buy it is to try it. Mm -hmm. And I'm not going to get them to get in front of me. Sometimes you just won't. They're just, they've already been in front of you. They're not going to. I have to respect that and honor that. So I'm pretty generous and I'll give them one or two, usually just one, but some people too, a bio mask. I'll put it in the little plastic bag with the bio mask instruction card. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell them about it, but I want them to try it. Hmm. This is one of those big things, <laughs> important products that I'm going to make a follow up. I might not remember to follow up the cheek color sample I gave them. I know that, but I'm going to follow up this, hmm. okay, and see how they like it because I want to sell it. This is seventeen dollars and fifty cents retail. Yeah, for mm -hmm. what? So I'm going to follow that up. Okay, so I get, I'm generous in giving those away. I always put. If they're ordering more than just mascara, I'm going to drop gifts in, depending on how new they are. The lip gloss, PCC gifts. Y'all know what these are? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. I'm going to have to pass that around. Um, oh, I actually put them in a towel bag mm -hmm. with a thought for the day. Because sometimes this is what I give out to somebody I meet. If I'm chatting with somebody or meet somebody, I'll give them one of these. Mm -hmm. I never give out two gifts. I give them something like this. This or this, the lip gloss PCP. This or this with a mascara. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Okay. Sometimes I even give veneer. You know, this is veneer with the, yeah. Yeah. what do you call that program? Don't, uh, look, away. don't look away. Don't look away. I put my don't, tell them what that is. I don't think everyone in the room knows what that is. <laughs> <laughs> you want to uh, know about the mirror, the program? And I'm going to pass um, around these cards. Basically, it's for um, domestic violence, and so at, what is it like? I think a portion of this sales or something goes to the program. It's called Don't Look Away. And also, your phone number, and so you can give it to someone who maybe is in a tough situation or whatever. Ooh. Oh, cool! You want to pass it around? Elizabeth has it. Can oh, you I pass it around? It's a little beat up, but yeah, so you, you can see. You can order them. There. I think I'm going to session two or something. Yeah, yeah. They're great gifts and brings awareness. So. Okay, so if somebody has bought, um, we'll just say Miracle Set from a party. It's my first time uh, meeting them, their first order with me. Okay. I, I, I like to give them free gifts because I want them to look forward to that, but I also recognize they just got me for free. Mm -hmm. That's a big deal. And if they bought a collection set from me, which they probably did, they just got a nice discount on that. Okay? So I might 
be a little more careful on how much I give away for free. Okay. But um what was that little card that was in the other side, other side. Oh, no, there's a card Oh, thank you. I'll tell you about that. Okay, so I'm putting the miracle set in. You want to be sure that miracle sets come with SPF. So if you are selling it without, to switch it out. Okay. And then I'm going to drop in their lookbook. And depending on what they talk about, what I heard from them, and interests and so forth will make a difference on what cards I give them. And I'm not going to overwhelm them with all. I might just pick one. Okay. Or if we were talking about a product, but she just wasn't really ready to spend the money. Okay. I'm going to drop this in. Okay. And that's got my business cards. And then I might give them, maybe I knew about some lipsticks they wanted to try. I, I put my lipsticks together in a little cello bag sample with a lipstick and a gloss and this one has a cheat color as well in my business card so I'll drop that in and then um, I don't know and then my mints okay all right so that's all pretty fast how I'm putting that together and, cream. and the hand cream yes seriously. now I actually I might not do the hand cream from a class because on my class remember in the cello bag everybody got a hand cream but I don't have to do that but otherwise, everyone's going to get the hand cream. So I maybe should have done this one from the class. But okay. Sorry. Oh, well. Now, um, then, this is what I have chosen because of the foil Mary Kay. Now, it looks kind of like a raspberry bee. So I have chosen polka dots because I love polka dots. And I have a tissue hanging for it's very handy for me in my studio. And the connections. And they're expensive. But they're worth it. But they're worth it. Okay. So and I'm not and I buy this from someplace where I get it in bulk. And I'm not going to be starting with it. Mm -hmm. But you see how fast I did that? Okay. And that's what I deliver. Okay, and that's what they think. It's pretty simple though, huh? Mm -hmm. The present. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I think it gets, I think it's a wow. Not balloons, not flowers. I don't take the time to spray it because it doesn't work for everybody. But I've got enough wow here, and when they start pulling things out, they're wowed more. Yeah. I, I it is fun because lately it's like, it's like, I don't know, it's like lately, because you don't always hear back from your customer, like, get it. But lately, I've been receiving texts saying, you know, I see the text, I see their name, and I just deliver on my whole crap. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> yeah. And I've had several lately that are like, thank you for my package. Thank you for the quickness. Thank you for all the goodies. They're all saying thank you for all the goodies. Now, do you okay. deliver at her work? Or <coughs> where would you deliver that? Wherever, wherever you do. do you agree? A lot of times it's home. How is it different from the mail? Well, if I'm mailing something to somebody for the first time, I want them to have this experience. So I get a box that I can lay this in, mm. I can lay down in, there's room for the tissue not to get crunched, and I'll mail it. Mm. When I, so you actually mail the bag in a box? Yes, oh, yes okay. in a box, oh, and I lay it down. Awesome. Okay, yeah. yeah. We have special boxes we've got that work for that size. But when I mail, if it's not going in one of those, just like us what you order all the time, I mail it in a plastic bag in the bubble envelope. There are people who just put all their product in the bubble, as well as the goodies. That's cool. I don't agree. <laughs> Neiman Marcus and Nordstrom's would never do it that way. They're going to package it somewhere, somehow, in that box. Would you not agree? Yes. Mm -hmm. Some way. With tissue or whatever. I'm not doing the tissue. Although I have to say, I, I have to say, when sometimes uh, when Danielle, um, is mailing boxes. If it's not in the bag, sometimes it's not in the bag and the product is in the boxes. She lines it with this tissue, puts a sticker on it that says, my, my customers are fabulous or something like that, but you can get from pinkprinting.com. Mm -hmm. Is that what it is? Yeah. Yeah. Those are yeah. So she's doing that. <coughs> I have a lot of wooden roses left because I used to do the wooden roses thing. So now she's putting one wooden rose across the top because I don't know what else to do with them. 
<laughs> but I do. She's going to talk about how she gets leads next week or the following. Yeah, that's that's going to be in one week. So I, I put my product in a plastic bag and then put this in a bubble. I think it's just so much nicer to pull this out and have everything in here. Okay. Um, oh, I, I love pink printing and all their fun stickers. And so I have a variety of them to put on the packages on the outside, to put on the box on the inside. And then this um, special delivery for the fabulous is a sticker. And I kind of hate to mess up the paper bag because some of them want to give them back to me. <laughs> they do. <laughs> oh, they do. Um, but I will put it down here, mostly for my Deborah, who delivers a lot of things. And that way she can see who's who. <laughs> but I decided that was better than a sticker because sometimes she might forget to take the sticky off. And I thought I did this, okay? Oh. Or if I give a whole bunch of orders to a hostess. And I don't do that very often. I usually give it to the people directly, but sometimes I go to the host, and that way everything is labeled. Okay. Um, when I'm giving, like if I meet somebody, um, like I, I just met somebody who said they might be interested in some Mary Kay. She was at the nail salon, and so um, uh, actually she did. She said she ordered the extra one at night. She's an only lady, so she knew about that and used it years ago. And so she said, just mail it to me. So I mail her order, and because it had been a long time since she was exposed to Mary Kay, I gave her a few cards of some of our products, and I gave her the hand cream. I also, I knew she used mascara. I gave her a full size mascara, and then I gave her this, okay? Because she wasn't, I knew she wasn't familiar with this. And I gave her the lip I mean, that's a lot, mm -hmm. but that's how I romance her. Now that was in July, right? And I've seen her a couple times at the nail salon. I don't even know if she remembers me, but uh, nothing. But I got a call the other day. And she goes, I, are you the lady at the nail salon and you sent me a blah, blah, blah? Said, yes, I am. Well, I got your lookbook. And it's the one from whenever with the look card in it. So that's been out a little while. Okay, I think it's been out a couple months, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. She goes, I just used it. And I love those colors. So I would like to have a makeover. And she says, can I accept all of my and And of course, absolutely. So it was worth it. It took seven months because I'll keep them on my mailing list a long time. I feel like that's an expensive as well. But it came back to me. I believe those things do. They really do. Okay. All right. So any questions about my packaging or what I do? Yes. What is it? Yeah. It's a little travel size. Makeup removal. I see that you have the label on the product label on that, right? Yes. I do. I'm not a product label person on my product, but I do it on some of my samples. My hand creams always. These things, they're I think they're on the box of the box that on the back of the box of the lip gloss. Lip glosses. I don't put labels on my product. Hmm. So that's just me. That's is it up. Don't want to do it. <laughs> do you guys have the box though? Or nope, nope. Nope. Mm -hmm. nope. She nope. probably talked to I do not want to mess with that. She probably reaches out to them enough that they exactly have right. your information. I keep my name in front of them. You yeah, don't stop you me don't reaching need out. Between yeah. Facebook, between email, between mailing. Mailing's not as much now because that's kind of passe, but I do do the mailings. And I keep reach yeah. How long do you keep them on your mail? Yeah, I mean, I took somebody off recently and they've been on my list for two and a half years. And, okay, and, and dang if they didn't tell me. Ah. The quarter they would not have No way. They did. And she spent a lot of money with me. And <laughs> she went back on your list. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. You have to tell them that story. That well, is pretty funny. Yeah. How you even got so Mary my Kay. first exposure to Mary Kay was still it was still at the end of she had got me onto this. Years ago she said I needed a brow pencil because I didn't have any brows. I don't have any brows. So I have to draw them in with my name in the butt every day. <laughs> I can tell you about them, but you know when you're trying to do it yourself, it's like 
never come out the same. But anyway, um, so she said, and the best pencil to get is Mary Kay Blonde. So she gave me hers. I liked it. And I happened to see a Mary Kay car in the parking lot of our bar office building. I sent my secretary out to find that person in the building and get her phone it. number. And I called her. She lived in Arvada. I do wish I knew who it was. Yeah. She lived in Arvada. Was it um, a pink Cadillac or just had a sticker? She just had a sticker. I don't, I don't remember. And how did your secretary find her? Like I she's chasing she people she around. Went, she went <laughs> and to be nice, you know, what's your name, what do you do, right? That's what I did. And she says, um, this was June. She goes, well, I just finished school. And I said, what did you get your degree in? I got a degree in political science. I said, really, what does a person do with a degree in political science? And she says, sell Mary Kay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so that gets your attention. Okay. So, <laughs> so I said, really? <laughs> Tell me more. <laughs> and, um, so she told me that she was like starving, needed food while she was getting through school in like the prior October. And somebody had told her about Mary Kay, so she signed up to make money. And now I realize she says I can make more money in Mary Kay than I can ever make in the lifetime of political science. Hmm. And so she says, You gotta come over sometime, blah blah blah, you know, to sell me in class. Well, Linda, who owned the restaurant, her aunt had a class, a little party. And Heidi said, Why don't you come to it? I did. I was close. I was the one with my arms folded. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I tried it and I did not buy. It. No. Not even, not even eyebrow <laughs> pencil? Not even eyebrow pencil. And let me tell you how she did color. It was all samples, no look cards. When we got to the color, she went like this and Ooh. spread the samples of the eyes that she pulled in. So just pick one. That's what she did. And she did pretty good doing that. <laughs> I'm just telling you, you know, you could do anything. And I wouldn't buy. I said, no, nope, maybe later. And so then I started, and she says, can I tell you about the opportunity? She had just got back from seminar. <clears throat> so I meet her for dinner. And uh, she tells me about it. I'm going, hmm, okay. I'm, I'm overthinking this. <coughs> I'm telling my husband about it. I decided I need to tell some, I need to think about this more. Told my sister-in-law. She goes, oh, Sherry, if you're going to do Mary Kay, you need to talk to Gloria. She was a customer of mine. She worked at Michael's. She's a customer of mine, and she is a big wig in Mary Kay. I said, okay. So I had lunch with Gloria. No. <laughs> Gloria, at the time, was an elite executive senior sales director. Okay? So um, I had lunch with her, and I said, okay, I'm thinking about this. She had this little gift. She took me to the Westland Hotel restaurant at the top of the Westland, something downtown Denver, because I was working downtown. That's why. And she says, um, I said, well, I'm thinking about this. I didn't really tell her I talked with Heidi. I said, I'm thinking about it. And I said, um, but before I do, I want to interview everybody at every level in huh. UK. <laughs> 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 I think I'm like a business uh, firm administrator for a CPA firm. We had our own firm. I'm thinking I'm just doing this the way you should. So, <laughs> And I said, I even want to interview and talk to somebody who's dropped out. Ooh. And she said, 
she goes, that's all good, but I'm kind of curious. If somebody goes to college, they interview people who have dropped out too. Ooh. Ooh. And so that caught my attention. That's why I decided not to do that. <laughs> In the meantime, Heidi's calling me again. Her recruiter is Marla Skilling, oh. who is also an emeritus. And she's telling me, why don't you meet with my recruiter, Marla? Well, this is the top woman in the company, an NSD. I said, okay. I met her out at Landry's, South oh. Denver, for lunch. And I said, she was here for lunch. Yeah, she was in our department. She did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So I meet with her, and I said, <laughs> yeah. Wow. I think she's still no, back and retired. Spent oh. time in Phoenix too. Okay. Wow. So, um, she's so I uh, said, okay. I'm still thinking about it. And then I go talk to Gloria again. Well, and then I talked to Heidi again. She invites me to a couple things that I don't go to. Mm -hmm. Have you ever had people who didn't show up? Yeah, yeah. that was me. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, I went to the free meal. I did not go to the events. <laughs> so Gloria finally, November, this is June to November, November, <coughs> Gloria invites me to a red jacket breakfast. Okay, so it's a breakfast, you hear from the red jackets, how they're moving up, they get spotlighted, blah, blah, blah. And I said, okay. So I wake up late on Saturday morning thinking I'm not going to go. And then I'm thinking, oh, I've already even bailed on Victoria a couple of times. And I thought, I really should do this. <laughs> I should go, right? I should be nice and go. I said, I would. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I show up 20 minutes late. Mm -hmm. And I listen to these Red Jacket mother stories who have just been promoted to Red Jacket. And I was in tears. Mm -hmm. And then her husband spoke, who is quite the gentleman from Czechoslovakia. And he had quite the story. And I was blown away by this. And I, I said, okay, I'm going to do it. And it just felt right to do it with her. She didn't know I'd been talking to all these other people, just that I had been talking about this. So I said, when did you meet? Or she said, come back to our meeting Monday. I said, okay. I drove home as a new Christian, giving God my order. I said, Lord, <laughs> I'm going to do this when I come back Monday night. And if you don't want me, that was my order. And so I went back Monday night and I stood up front and as a beauty consultant, my check bounced. <laughs> for her starter really kit. nice to me about it. Yeah. <laughs> and for I her starter kit, you yeah, guys. Like that's yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I hear I all the time with top people that their yeah. check bounced again. I wrote a hot check. No, it was a hot check. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Like that is crazy. What did the company do? Like they've already they sent me like, nice oh, all these yeah. you You know, you yeah. might want to set this a good check. That's why they moved over to credit cards. Marla Skillings, she had other, I mean, these are all part of her lineage, and so they're there. And I'm feeling very convicted with Marla's there. Now, she does not remember me, yeah. but, um, and Jan Harris was there, oh my word. So I'm sitting on the sofa in the suite next to Marla's, mm -hmm. and I have to tell her. And I tell her the story, and she remembers it, but it's like, really, you're the one, or whatever. She goes, <laughs> she, was, she was so nice. She just took my hand and said, it's okay, and you know, it's just not a problem. It was just all okay. But I think it was probably good because I, she got to hear from me really the story of how it happened that Gloria did not know yeah. what, how she I had been talking her. to all these people. So it was kind of comical. And then since then, we would be, she's, she did a <coughs> thing for me. She yeah. did a speaking thing to me. And she was cool. Yeah. It was really special. Right. But I felt I had to tell her. So. Anyway. Thanks for sharing that. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think, but I think, huh? Oh, no. 
No, she went on to get another degree and she's a lawyer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. But that's okay. great encouragement for those of us who have followed up and followed up and followed up and people who come to a party like this and aren't going to buy anything, think of Sherry <laughs> next time, okay? Yeah. Next time you have that happen, think, yeah, just love on them. And both and just Sophie and Sophie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Let me tell you something to write down. Ready? This is very profound. My business is her leisure. My business is her leisure. And if you will just understand that, you won't be hurt, you won't be crushed, you won't be mad, you won't be angry by all those cancellations and those people that blow you off. And that's how I was treating it with those ladies when they would invite me to things and I wasn't showing up. It was just leisure to me, but it was her business. Yeah. But I, I don't understand that. And we're not, we're, the customer never is, really. Okay? And there are personalities that would just understand you don't do that, and so they never would. And then there are others that are like, so we cannot be hurt, crushed, and disappointed by all that. We have to move on. In fact, what I truly believe is you have to love them more. Love them and give them compassion, not even knowing their story, that you don't know their story, and you don't know what it is, and go ahead and give them the benefit of the doubt. There was a good reason that they just blew you off. Okay? So Sherry didn't show up to a lot of things. And I just, didn't. Uh, and she was late. And she was late. So 20 minutes <laughs> late. And then she just flaked on things, and here she is. Yeah. So you exactly. never know. Exactly. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Okay, so. Any questions about how I'm packaging? Anybody? Beautiful. No, but oh, I okay. agree on like the mascaras and the uh, eye makeup removers. Like I bought a bunch of them as samples and I carry them off everywhere. Yep. And I know they're expensive to do that, but I just try to clean them out for people mm -hmm. because they're gonna fall in love with it if I've mm -hmm. never done anything with like a big okay. or a full size product. And I'm like, oh now I need more of it. Mm -hmm. Instead of trying to make it <coughs> yep. something that gets more. So I yeah. have some very faithful users for the lash intensity. And that lash intensity, I I just got aggressive and I gave that away to a lot of people. So you just gotta try it. it. Mm -hmm. You just gotta try it. And there were some who didn't like it. But I made a lot of um just built a lot of rapport with them because I would give that to them to try. Mm -hmm. But I have faithful customers for that. Mm -hmm. I how many of you have uh, mascara users, for example, that are set up? I mean they just tell you ship it to me on this day, everybody. Anybody done that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I do it. I don't set it up with the company. I do it because I think you can set it up with the company. But I offer it to my customers. So I have a handful of customers that just say, on the 13th, send me this. So one loves Lash Love, and she wants two tubes a month. Two wow. tubes a month. Oh, what is she doing with it? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Is a lot of yes. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, she has a favorite thing. Favorite thing? No. Favorite thing? No. Tell us what those are. Um, <laughs> you just, you know, you're maybe gonna invite a bunch of girlfriends. Maybe you're gonna invite two girlfriends. It's just a little gathering, like having home parties, right? And it's favorite things. And everybody is supposed to bring ten gifts of their favorite thing. Hmm. And under a certain amount, under ten dollars, she can listen. <laughs> 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 And so maybe somebody's favorite thing is a cleaning product. Maybe yeah. it's a cosmetic product, yeah. whatever, or maybe it's something else. And you wrap it, and she made up these beautiful plates, and there were 10 plates with all these gifts on. Well, the favorite thing she wanted everybody to have was a mascara. Huh. So she oh, ordered 10 mascaras. Huh. Well, yeah. That's so pretty cool. cool. You can do favorite things. Parties are very okay. I know. I thought you found a very cute party. Yeah. Realize, that's, so. Yeah. Okay. So what we're going to do next is who's going to be my first volunteer? Kanisha. Kanisha. What? Kanisha. Oh, Dina! 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 Throw under the bus! She's up! <laughs> That's enough for you. Hey, <laughs> you're all going to watch. <laughs> you're all going to watch. <laughs> what we recorded earlier, so you can see me do the pose again. And I didn't even do a pose face. But what we have is at least two people, and maybe call call three, lined up to come up here, and they're going to do the pose in front of all of us. And you guys have had enough training from me on Boxer, plus what you get on the recording today. <coughs> and I think you got the gist of how we're doing things. And we're going to critique her. We're going to give her our feedback. 
it going to be positive feedback because she needs to know what she did right and what she did good, okay? But we're also going to tell her where she can sharpen it up and fix it up or tighten it up or whatever to be better. Because we are not better unless we make each other better. Do you all agree with that? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so we have to be brutally honest with her. Brutally honest doesn't mean nasty, and we're not going to be that way. It means we need to give her our honest feedback. Okay. If you guys weren't at the first training session, grab one of these. Yeah, we can have you want me to set up some other stuff? Yes. Yeah. And um, I think she said she'll push this back. And yeah, I'll push this back so you can have it right here. And to start with, everybody who comes up here. <laughs> Look at all of our ladies. Go, Dina! No, the way it is on the form. So if they were looking at the sheet, no, 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 it's going to be all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Foundation, your primer, this amazing foundation brush. Ooh. Yes. Ooh, your soothing eye gel, which has cucumber extract, which is gonna get rid of all your puffiness. Your charcoal mask, mm, this is amazing. Your satin lips and your satin in the jar. Mm. Hey, and then it comes with all of your color in your little compact that you can fill up with your customized color look. Okay, it's going to have your Eye colors, lip color, lip gloss, eyeliner, lip liner, and mascara. And all of this can be yours. It is a value of two, $526 <coughs> for only three nine. dollars Okay, 
going to get the amazing brush set so you can do your makeup like a professional right everybody wants it and you're going to get for free this roll-up bag everybody Ooh. Say, Ooh. Ooh. Ah. so you can store all of your, your skin care your makeup your body care everything that you need you can hang it up you can roll it up and you can act like you're Janet Jackson <laughs> And <laughs> now the next one because we're three princesses, right? Yeah. Yes. Right. So next one is our princess line. Now you're gonna get our premium skincare line of the cleanser, the day, the night cream, the eye cream, the foundation, the foundation primer, the amazing brush, foundation Ooh. brush, the eye makeup remover, the amazing charcoal mask. Oh, satin lips. And satin in a jar, Ooh. and our eye cream, our eye gel. So this one, you're going to get satin hands for free. Everybody like free? Yes. Everybody like free. And the roll-up bag. Ooh. Hey, ah. this comes with everything between except for color. So you can buy your color separately oh. because we all love the way our color looks, right? Right. Yeah. So that one does not come with color. You do have the choice to custom, do a customized color look with that of your choice. So the next one is, our, if we move on over, is our Goddess on the Go. That comes... Thank you. The, the princess of quite a lot uh, gives you the value of $358 for only $287. Woo! So you're getting $71 free. Who likes free? Woo! Free is for me. So if you go over here next is the Goddess on the Go. That comes with our premium skincare line with our cleanser, our day and our night cream, our eye cream, your foundation, your foundation primer, your brush, your... <laughs> Woo! Woke me up a little bit. Uh, your soothing eye gel. Oh, and your satin lips. It does not come. Button in the door. Yeah. Yes. So that is a value of $266. You are going to get the free roll up bag. Ooh. Yeah. Everything that you need in all your slots, you can put it however you want, roll it up. If you're, you don't need to have shared space with somebody in it, you can hold it down a jacket. <laughs> Thank you, Debbie. So that's a thirty-five dollars for free. Thirty-five dollars for free. Everybody likes free, right? Yeah. Okay, and going down the next set we have is our miracle set three collection. We have our miracle set three D plus. So that comes with our skincare, the day and the night cream, the eye cream, and get your face ready with the foundation primer, the foundation, and the amazing brush. <laughs> Not that. Not that. <laughs> but we do have our basic collection with the. How much is that? Oh, that was that's one seventy eight. Our basic miracle three D set is our cleanser, our day and our night cream, and you will get your foundation and the brush. <laughs> and these two at the bottom don't come with free, but I do have them available today. And the, the Miracle Basic 3D is 124. Woo! Ooh, that was and, that. <laughs> and then what are we going to do now? Oh, and yes, and so you're going to take this. And does anybody, I'm going to do the one on one. Okay, does anybody need to do first? All right. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, Gina! Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Now, Gina, this is your first time ever doing it. Ever, ever, ever. Yes, it is. Wow. You did pretty good. I did <laughs> uh, I volunteer because I did not volunteer. And when you do our thing, then you can yeah. So be a little bit gentle on the other side. Debbie. I love that 
nodded your head when you wanted everybody to say yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was so great. And you were just excited. Yeah. And you were. The I energy. Was, yeah. Mm -hmm. That is really good energy. Yeah. <laughs> I would love that you remember to get dollars on the free stuff <laughs> yeah. and the actual value of it. So didn't mention the dot. Saying the word dollar when you were giving them the price. That was very good. I liked how every time you sat down, you took away stuff. Yeah. To show them the actual visual. Did you get this? That's not good. Yeah. <laughs> That's the first time we actually had to see it. And, and you know, like, like that. Yeah. yeah. Make it that like that mm -hmm. thing to do with the food to see what they actually get or what they can do with it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Rat lips? Yes, it's rat lips. I think you had amazing energy to get to yeah. see something absolutely fabulous. Um, I love that you went through everything each time. The only particular thing I think that will set you on top is, um, like Ms. Sherry said, if you just leave it, someone leaves a, a skincare set, that's great. So at the end, I was on the last one, like, we can still take care of you, make sure your skincare is mm -hmm. taken care of. Mm -hmm. So even though we want you to buy the, the clean set, still, oh, and, hey, we have you covered with just the basic skincare, you know, so. I would throw in beautiful, healthier, younger, yeah. beautiful, beautiful yeah. skin now that I am going to what go home it? and find the mirror practice. Younger, healthier, more younger, healthier, more beautiful. Okay, anyone else? Janet, yes. That's not mine. I copied. Yeah. But y'all can copy now. Yeah, yeah we're well, all copying her. It's hilarious. Make them Make them Yeah. 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 Okay, so at the end, you're ready to go, you're not supposed to do this. Okay, everybody, 
everybody. This is my favorite part. This is where it gets back on. You can have it all. No, you can have it all. I like it. Yeah, Come on. <laughs> <laughs> one more thing. I think since you did this, this is one of those, you know, you were struck, it's like you're starting in the middle of the class, right? Yes. But you were, you were doing a few things to romanticize each product. I think you don't need to do that. Okay. You just need to get through the fold. Okay. The few things might be as minimal as when you get that in the jar, you just say, and you get, and oh, this is a fun thing. You get to choose the luxurious hydrating cream of your choice. Mm. That in your jar. Okay. Okay. Now the reason I would say luxurious hydrating cream is because somewhere you have said lack of hydration is the biggest danger of our skin. So we have this luxurious cream to give us the hydration that we need. So that's going to be my key phrase that people are going to want is added hydration. So I would say you get to pick. The luxurious hydrating gel of cream of your choice, that in the jar. Okay. So they know it's a choice and they're not getting both. But other than that, I would try to keep your um, really, really brief, maybe just one word adjective if you're going to do it on each of the products because you've already done the romancing of it earlier. That makes sense. Okay. Going through the clothes more deeply. Okay. Okay. Right? Good job. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, wait, I'm taking my mint and I'm going to eat it in front of all of you guys. <laughs> Is that rude? Woo! I don't know why, but it's like way, way more nerve wracking to be in front of you guys than as yes, it is. Well, probably because I don't know them, right? And I'm like, right. Yeah. All right, cool. So, <laughs> I don't know, right? So, this is also my first time doing this for cheap. So, I'm excited though because I really. I want to do this on Wednesday, and so I'm glad that I'm getting the practice in front of everybody that I love. <laughs> okay. All right. So, did you guys have a good time tonight? Woo! Yes. Woo! Great. This is my favorite part. I get to show you how you can do it all. So, in here, like all. Great. Okay. So, before we do that, I would like everybody to close your eyes. No peeking. Close your eyes. I'm watching you. Everybody, um, put both hands on your face. Is that soft? Yeah. Don't you want to wake up uh, every day with your skin this soft? Yeah. Uh, me too. All right, go ahead and open your eyes. All right, so what you have in front of you is our um, set of collections that we offer. Um, you can get everything individual, but this is um, put together very well thought out of uh, the products that are best um, to put in collections. <laughs> that sounds terrible. The best five. Okay, cool. All right, great. Um, so on the back of it is and everybody likes free, right? And with free stuff, so everybody likes free, right? Who in here likes free? Great. Um, on the back of it is my report card. So you can tell me um how I did. You can be really, really honest with me and tell me um how you thought I did and where I can improve. Great. So the first um set um for your younger, healthier, more beautiful skin is the queen of everything. Um, with the Queen of Everything, you get our premier um, cleansing, uh, premier skincare, thank you, premier skincare set. Um, you also get the foundation primer and the foundation with this amazing foundation brush. You also get the satin lips, eye makeup remover, our amazing indulging soothing eye gel. Um, you get the, did I say anything? The amazing charcoal mask and your choice of the luxuri luxurious hydrating cream creams of your choice. That one. Um, that is um, a five hundred and twenty-six dollar value. Yours for three ninety-nine. Uh, oh. <laughs> All right, rewind. I didn't say that part, the last part. Okay, rewind. <laughs> you also get um, all of our, our full size color looks. So you get a compact, you get three eyeshadows, a blush, um, your, your compact tools. You also get a lip gloss, a lipstick, a lip liner, an eyeliner, and a mascara. All um, at a $526 value for $399. You also get um, free gift. Two in here, like, Free. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two. So you get a full size um, satin hand, 
Um, we also get our um, very prestige um, I, uh, brush, essential brush collection. <laughs> and then you also get our amazing travel size roll up bag. Um, yes. Ah, I want one, right? Um, this is amazing because you can put your skincare, your makeup, your brushes, and your care supplements. Uh, supplements and your body care. And my favorite part, if you're on the go like me, you can uh, rip this up and take it with you. Wow. It rolls up um, and fits right in the corner of your suitcase. So there's a trouble. Okay. <laughs> the next collection that we have is a uh, princess of quite a lot um, because we are all queens and princesses, right? Yeah. And in princess of, of quite a lot, you get the premier, um, I'm having a hard time with this thing right now. Skincare, Skincare set. For younger, more healthier, more beautiful skin. Um, you also get a foundation primer and a foundation with this amazing brush. You get the eye makeup remover, the satin lips, the charcoal mask, the indulging soothing eye gel, our most luxurious hydrating cream. That means that works. Um, but you do not get any of this. Um, and so it is a, oh. Yeah, it's a $358 value, yours for $287, but you also get free gifts with this one. You get the full-size set in hand, and you also get the amazing roll-up bag. Ooh, ah, I want one, right? <laughs> Our next collection set is Goddess on the Go. Um, on Goddess on the Go, you get the um, premier skincare set. Um, you also get a foundation, a, a smooth care set for younger, more healthier, beautiful skin. You also get the foundation primer and the foundation. Um, still with the foundation brush, the eye makeup remover, the satin lips, and indulging eye gel, but you do not get the luxurious um, satin in the jar or the charcoal mask. And that is a two. I don't want one. <laughs> that is a two hundred and sixty-six dollar value for 231 and you also get to take home the beautiful travel bag set. Ooh, wow, I love it, right? <laughs> the next set that we have, um, you don't get anything for free, but they're still great. Um, you get the Miracle Set 3D. Um, you get the um, cleanser, the day cream, the night cream, the eye cream. You get the foundation primer and the foundation with the foundation brush. You do not get um, the satin lips, indulging student eye gel, or the eye makeup remover, and that is 178. And then for our basic miracle set 3D, you get the um, four in one cleanser, the day cream, the night cream, um, the liquid foundation, <coughs> and the lick, and the foundation brush. Okay, um, and great. So now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna. Um, go ahead and meet with everybody individually. And as I'm doing that, if you would be so kind and fill out the back um, of the sheet. Um, and is there anybody in here that needs to leave first? Okay. <laughs> 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 like in the other sets there's so much that it's like hard to go through and I was trying to get through it quickly and then when we got to like the want, want, want sets there was like not so many so much so I went like, um I, I have something to ask you on that but 
Let me see what we want to say. I was going to say, I love your energy and you take care of your energy. I would just rest, I would just literally reading off the paper stuff mm -hmm. that says, time wise for you, skin set. And then you can say, oh, you're young, more beautiful skin, yeah. and then we go, give a four and one pleasure. Yeah. So just use your paper. So you can read it, boom, right off there. Yeah. Your yeah. energy and your positivity will go just all the way. So yeah. that's like, yeah, thank you. Yeah. I think I'm a picture girl, so I was looking at the picture and not the words. Yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> well, that's that's the first one. So. Because on the screen of everything, um, the, 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 the skin care essentials, the flawless foundation application, the eye essentials, and the refreshers, you have to start there and then go over to that for the colors to follow because oh, it's not listed okay. there first. So you just follow that. And then you oh. add those extra lines in there when you go over to this. And I have to say to you, Sherry, sorry to get out of the corner. <laughs> <laughs> my clothes. You only have that corner. My clothes up until this point have been, okay, thank you everybody for coming. I put this stuff away and they go, wait, how do I get stuff? And so I'm always just here and asking for them. So thank you for the tools and stuff. I think it's just helping. Yeah. Yeah. able to go forward because that's always been my my, my yeah. So thank you. you made excellent points, excellent points. I love the part about the reading that you said because we read the book of something. So it's okay to read some books. Okay? And the special page is comfortable. I used to go after these books. So anyway, good. Yes. I have a question, and this might be something that you put in there specifically. But um, we tend to focus on the positive. And so, should we be mentioning what they're not getting in the app? Absolutely. Okay. Because and we want to let them know yeah. what they're missing out. Nobody yeah. wants yeah. things yeah. taken away. It's, it's, like it's one of those away. times we want to. Okay. Yeah. But that's a very good mention because we even specifically talked about that in our earlier meeting. But I know it seems negative, but we want to draw attention to that. Yeah. The want, want. <laughs> Should we say want, want, want? Because I feel like it's very natural. I think that. Uh, I think that I, to me, I'm fine with that. Obviously, you're going to have certain groups of people maybe. So I was the girl with eighty. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you were sitting there with eighty-year-old women, maybe they wouldn't. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess that. I guess that. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yes. But I liked it. Yes. Just one minor detail is that they get listed for lip gloss now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. There's a little on there. Can I just say, Commissioner, so easy to be on this side. Uh, we don't cheat. Because we have critiqued with a third one now. Mostly we've got the gist of it, but then we're getting really good at critiquing. All of us need to be at the same time. Yeah, I would, yeah. Yeah. I would like to say something positive. Um, I love. It just never, it didn't occur to me. I love how you say the free gifts that you get. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't even think about that. You get the satin hands, the, the roll up bag, the brush set, the brush collection. Mm -hmm. They're your free gifts. I think I, I think I heard you say that. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, it's because I didn't hear that. Before. It's because we're, we're learning so yeah. much from her and it's yeah. like certain things I don't hear and I hear from you. Yeah, she is cool that she noticed that because I'll tell you something. I noticed that with you. She kept calling it free. But the thing is, what's wrong with free? Nothing. And I didn't want to, I'd already said a lot of things. I didn't want to say that because it's like, okay, that's my secret. But the reason I like free gifts is because free by itself is like nothing's free, baby. <laughs> right? You know, it could just free react that other connotation. But free gifts, you put that word gifts with it as a gift. I don't know. That's just me. That's kind of why I get gifts. Free gifts, gifts makes it a little, it's like it softens it a little bit. And I didn't say gifts, did I? No. Okay. No. Good. What did she say? Yeah. Oh, free. You said what you get for free. free. Oh, free. Oh, free. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But uh, gifts so, is so <laughs> awesome how you picked up on that. Yes. Yeah. I know. That's, that's so great. funny. Because yeah. there's lots of stuff that like I don't hear and then I pick up on certain things and I'm like, oh, here, 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 here. And it's not. Right. right. Like the choice of not looking at the back of the box you would have said. Point of yeah. yeah. Now the other thing I said use the word collection. That is something we kind of figured out when we went through this is what is perceived or heard differently or heard more positively. Words can matter. That's why you use the word dollar sometimes and other times you don't. That's why 
are you when you're talking to your customer you say let's schedule you we always say book mm. but with them say schedule because people want to be booked like put them down so collection instead of saying value i would say your free gifts are or your this collection what I heard a lot of so, so far is a 500 and some dollar value. I would say a 500 and some dollar collection for $358. That is $126 in free gifts. I know that might sound picky because I'm saying to you guys, say it this way. But they matter. But they really can matter. And if you just say it that way, then you won't get mixed up and coming up with, well, does that word work? And does that not work? You know what I'm saying? So follow me on that. So collect because when you start using the word value, you start using the word price, now they feel like they're being sold. And I did not want to be sold, right? right? There's a lot of other people like me. And so that actually was a good point from Abby and some others when we were doing this at our studio. And so she said it really felt better when I was using the word collection. And especially because on the front end of the party, I said, you're not obligated to do anything but have a good time. Mm -hmm. Nobody's obligated, but should you decide to buy or purchase, we do have the products and we do accept MasterCard, Visa, blah, blah, blah. Take care of saying those words at the front end. So that when you get to this part, you're not having to say, oh, by the way, we take blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Because I said it wasn't about sales. I want to keep this smooth. I want to keep this easy and comfortable because they're going to, you'll have more than a <coughs> Okay. All right. Anything else for her? Yeah. Um, I use trick or treat. I think that's just from my dealer dealer's days. Mm -hmm. We had our holiday sales and stuff like that. Like all those different collections that say they do have prime Like get this collection, your gift of purchase will be mm -hmm. to the yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's perfect. Yeah. Anybody else? Yeah. So I know you said this already, but I, I was so busy listening to you that I didn't write it down. Okay, could you just say one more time how you incorporate the collection with the, if it's a value or, could you just say it one more time for me? So, I would say, whoops, I would say, I'm describing it, I have to kind of get myself there. I would describe it and I would say, okay, when I get done, I would say, this is a $526 collection for $399, that's $126 in this mm. That's what I would say. Thank okay. you. Now, when you get to the end, there was some discussion about the end on um, separating and stuff. Um, I, Abby reminded me of this. I am noticing we're talking a little bit more in the end about these collections and you really don't need to or want to. There is a balance. We're, I mean, I used to just have three, but I, you know, I kind of had to have that there, but that's why there are no gifts. So you really want to make sure it's incidental. Okay. So I would truly just get to the end and say, we have your miracle set, you know, you can say the titles. And what you're getting in either one of these sets is basically you're getting food, shelter, and water. <laughs> oh, that's good. Well, and, <coughs> and leave it at that. And stop, right? And not describe them. Food, shelter, and water. You're, 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 the whole idea of this is you're putting yeah, your yeah, emphasis yeah. on these three. Yeah. This is where you want them to be. Right. If they can or don't want to be, they're going to go in here, but that's going to be on their own. I didn't guide them there. <laughs> okay? It's going to be one of these three. Okay? I loved your energy. I thought everybody's energy was great. You, you owned it. And that's what's good. And this is your first time. You're going to get better and better. I feel like I hope you're okay with all the tips I gave you I because am. you cannot be better without hearing these things that you can sharpen up. No, I really appreciate it. Okay, yes, thank you. I'm doing Wednesday yes. for class of nine. Yeah. yeah. Um, I needed to do that. <laughs> I think I'll practice it tomorrow, though. <laughs> 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 the other thing about the roll-up, so sometimes we have to coach our roll-up star. Okay. Savannah, okay. Oh, but when um, your hostess, my hostess or my, or my Ooh. consultant Ooh. Do not come, okay? Can I borrow it? So I this is me, okay? I want to make sure that they are seen. 
So this is your roll up. This, and so you're gonna say, and for free, you get this travel roll up. Is that not so awesome? See how that can pack so nicely in your hand. Or be under the counter if you are face challenged in the back. So you want to paint the picture why this is coveted. Okay? Because I was telling them earlier, I only give this away for free right here. I have never offered deals or promotions ever, ever, ever with gifts. The only way they get it for free is when they buy one of these collections. Okay? So you you've got the picture of this is so coveted. Okay? That's why you're doing the do all I want it. Do they know what the heck you're talking about? Why do I want that? Okay, but they're following you. And that's a good thing because they went along with you and they will. So he said, so you kind of described, doesn't that look nice? And then after you said those couple words, and he said, and it opens up, and she does a fun little vanna, a little bit of drama with it, right? It opens up, hook at the top, so the contained in the bathroom at the hotel, or in yours, if you're space challenged, and you can have your skincare, your supplement, your color, your body care. Then when you're describing it on the next step, because they're not getting color, you go through the whole thing again, just like you say, younger, beautiful, every time. You go through the whole thing again, you say, and then you can build on your bag with skincare, supplements, and add your color later and body care. See what we're suggesting? Mm. And then here, got us on the, or here, got us on the go. Again, you can build on your bag, and you've got a place for your skincare and your supplements. If you're going through the whole, okay, rolls up nicely, drops in the suitcase, opens up. Hangs in your face challenge, hotel room, <coughs> blah, 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 blah. You with me? So romance is too, because I can count on one hand how many did not want this, but sometimes I find someone who don't, doesn't, and then they get to trade that for something. Okay? Oh, and by the way, sometimes, it depends on my group, when we're talking about the roll-up, and I will say, you know, the ooh, I want it, and we're talking about it, and say, and you know what? I have a lot of customers that buy too. Mm. Who travel yeah. and they don't want to pack that every time they have to travel. They mm -hmm. buy too. So I'm just saying. And I just brought it. I would suggest it. I just use yeah. a master so, at it. So suggesting why not? And I have customers right. buy too. They maybe didn't do it right then, but they do it shortly thereafter. Because they don't like packing. How many of you travel two every time a year? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I want to know. Keep your hands up. <laughs> Keep your hand up if you have two of these put together. Very good. <laughs> All right, you are your best customer. You're supposed to be your best customer. You should have two of these put together. Okay? I have two color compacts, everything. There is nothing. When I'm getting ready in the morning, that I'm going to travel, there is nothing that I am doing that I have to worry about getting in my suit. Nothing. I put all my toiletries, travel toiletries in there too. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to have double of everything because I will not remember. And the last thing I want to forget is anything in my cosmetic. <laughs> I learned going oh, yeah. to Dollar Weekend. I did not have my skincare in my roll-up bag, and that's when I got my second roll-up bag. And I have one that stays in my bedroom, hanging on the back of the door, and I have one in the bathroom. So when I travel, it's ready. Because I, I went to a Mary Kay function without skincare. <laughs> it's a good thing you were around a bunch of ones that did, though, right? And you get a chocolate. Oh, I already uh, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> So this compact, I just pulled this for my purse, so this is mine. But normally I would just have three eyeshadows and a cheek color. This is just odd because I pulled it for her to have something to show. Okay, I think we're supposed to be done. So I wanted so I have a question. First of all, I really do think y'all did fabulous. Yes. So yes. Yes. Oh, about Miranda. Oh, did you go? No, selling the Queen of everything. Oh, yes, thank you. Miranda, come up here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't know. <laughs> How long have you been at the public? It's in January, don't worry, you got everything right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you just put the information on, and if the director can get in you, and you just can do what you were told, right? So last <laughs> week you had a guest, yeah. and we closed with the policy, yeah. and you followed up with her, yeah. and you
and you went through it like you're supposed to. And what did you tell us? I did. I pretended like I knew what I was saying. But every day that I had no idea. Yeah, when she said that, I was like, Are you sure? Sound like you're my first person ever. But yeah. She had ordered another amount of things that she totally spent a thousand dollars. Okay, one person. One person. Okay. Now I didn't, and she was the one, and I said, "This is what you all can get to. You'll have one of these one day." Because I was telling them, she's the one. I started to show her the clothes sheet. I barely got through the completely or the queen of everything, <coughs> and she touched me. She says, "Sherry, you could just stop right there because I just want everything." <laughs> and that's what she said. So when she said everything, and that's even then everything I talked about beyond what's on the clothes sheet, and then some, okay? And then the next day, she bought more color looks. She said, just pick three for me, and that's what we did. So that's kind of fun, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Those don't happen all the time, but they will, and you do have that to look forward to. But I totally believe it's when you have that abundant thinking, which comes with your confidence in the product, the company, and what you're using. There's a lot of discussion earlier, you'll hear it when you listen, about how do you know how to sell something when you don't use it or you're not trying, you haven't tried it, whatever. When you love this company, when you love the product, when you believe in it, when you're passionate about it, you can sell anything that this company has because you trust it and you believe it. I go to the expo and I spend a lot of time talking to the people who are developing the product, who are scientists. I spend a lot of time talking with them, this is just me, about how we test it. And before it gets to market and everything. And so I have even more confidence and belief in this company because of the integrity of it. So 
So even if you've not done what I've done to talk to them, you've probably heard enough that you trust that. I'm, my personality is I wanted to talk to them to understand because I like to talk about it. And that's okay, but just trust that. And let that exude out of you in confidence, belief, and passion about this company. Because it'll come through in all that you do and all that you get back in your sales. So next week, because I don't have time now, although I have to be reminded of the freshness of the story, but I shared with them a story and the process <coughs> of when you call to get that booking. And she goes, I, I just need to talk to my friends and see what the gift is. Now, when you hear that, what do you do? You say, okay, I'll follow up with you. Am I right? Mm -hmm. I mean, is that what you do? Anybody do anything different? I do. What do you do different? I say, let's go ahead and just pencil in something because uh, that you can, you're not going to get everybody there at that particular date. Let's right. just pencil in something and we can change it. Okay. okay. That's excellent. Now, when you say that, if they come back and say, no, I'm with my girlfriend, then you're done? Yeah. Okay. So, first of all, kudos to you. She deserves a applause for that. <laughs> And that's why you're a director of maintenance, because that's what we talked about. But I'm going to show you the process of taking it further. And it's having really, it's really having the confidence in what you're doing. And the belief in what you're doing. And that means you're not holding back because, oh, she probably doesn't think I'm going to We're going to get over that, ladies. We are. Yeah. 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 And when you call your friends, you're always worried about, well, they're going to think I only call them when I want them. So we're going to talk about that because how many of you can relate to that one? Yeah. They are your friends. They should let you call. <laughs> and if they don't, shame on them. I really believe that. So you're going to own that one. But I'm going to say one thing to send you home with, and that is with that, one of the phrases that I use with my friends is, Hi, Dina. Where's Dina? Over here. Over here. I was looking at Debbie. But anyway, hi, Debbie. <laughs> and you're my good friend. I'm just calling, I'm just letting you know, right now, I'm wearing my Mary Kay hat. Oh, thank you. Good. There you That's go. really good. Yep. That is really, really good. Yep. I love that. And if I want a sense of urgency, because I don't want to have conversation of how you're doing, <laughs> what's going on, because you feel bad, you feel like you should be checking in with them. And I've just got a few minutes. Have you got a minute? Okay. Mm, that's good. You that. just laid it out. This is a few minute conversation. And it's all about Mary Kay. Mm -hmm. That's good. Okay. Isn't she awesome? Yeah. Woo! Thank you. That's just a taste of what y'all are going to get next time. It's really how to master booking and booking for yeah. bookings and how to. Yeah. She doesn't go around and warm chatter or do any of the, the flowering stuff. That's when she gets rid of flowers. So I'm just saying if y'all want to learn how you get really good at getting your business to propel itself, come back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So y'all are going to come back for the next two weeks, right? Yeah. Yeah. So get on your feet and send us our power and say it. Say it like you mean it. I'm great. I am 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 great. I am